Hello YouTube! So today, we are looking at all the Valorant skin sets and uh, determining what these skins say about you as a player, as an individual, as a person. If you guys want to see this stuff live, come on over to twitch.tv slash and if you do enjoy the content, please consider subscribing to the YouTube channel. Okay, first things first, gotta name the tiers. This is not really a formal tier list, it's very informal. We have all the skins over here. I think this one stands for I have no money so i use this skin the top tier should be a cultured cultured person you have way too much money bandwagon fan streamer only skin okay okay e-daters i like this one i'm quirky all right we need one more absolute weirdos okay let me just change the colors let's see here i just gotta arrange this so cultured person's up here streamer only i think uh, it can go up there let's put the e-daters like up here okay you know what i'm gonna add one more we're gonna add can't aim in the slightest i like that cannot aim for their life okay this is our tier list chat let's just get every breed of person well not breed but every type of person first skin we have the uh what skins are these i don't even know what skins these are arrow who the hell buys arrow i have never seen this in my life it's either absolute weirdos or i'm quirky just because no one has this you guys agree right screw it you're going to absolute weirdos what is this it's the graffiti looking skins this is a battle pass skin right which means that i have no money and i use this skin correct i've never seen anyone use this skin and then say that oh i like this skin you guys should buy it it's underrated it's oh it's a i have no money i'm, I'm gonna use this all right this one is goaded 100 percent. i think this goes all the way up here to cultured person the arcane sheriff is amazing it is the only skin that has that twirly twirly animation that is so good now we get to the interesting ones we've got the uh, aristocrat i've seen some people with this i think this goes to i'm quirky these are the people that swear by yeah th there they are they're coming out these are the people that swear by the aristocrat skins oh the, it's pretty nice you guys, you guys just gotta appreciate it all right moving on we've got uh what is this the it's a china plate looking one battle pass skins go in here this is a battle pass tier basically all right avalanche skins i like this one i think the avalanche skins are a streamer skin i have not seen a non-streamer use this skin ever i'm putting it in streamers only because when this skin set relaunched when valorant was launched in the first place i saw a bunch of these on streamers wait does chat really want them and weirdos wait you guys want it? okay there you go is this what you guys want yeah okay blast x skins this is hard it's not an i'm quirky skin i think blast x it's not a streamer only thing too i think blast x is you have way too much money man like it's a good skin i'm not gonna lie if i were to just buy one skin set i wouldn't buy the blast x i'm gonna put it up here you have way too much money all right what is this monstrosity i don't know why but this screams e-daters to me it's a battle pass skin i know you guys are spamming cannot aim okay fine the cavalier and cannot aim for their life yoikers moving on we've got the uh, celestial skins these are decent I think they are streamer only. Okay, it's not streamer only, but I'll just name a streamer skin. Because I've seen like Shroud Flex use these skins, and I think they're streamer skins. Wait, why e daters? Why do you guys think this is an e dater skin? Do most e daters use the celestial skins? The fan? Oh, right, because of the fan. I forgot about the fan. I've seen Flo use the fan. I've seen Noodle use the fan. I know people. Yeah, dude, this is a streamer skin, man. I'm sorry. I gotta overrule. This is a streamer skin. This is. I've seen way too many streamers use the celestial. All right, champions bundle. Anyone? E-daters for sure. I think this is if you have too much money. Not gonna lie. This is 100% if you have too much money, if you have, you have disposable income to spare. It was so expensive for a knife and a vandal only. I have it, by the way. It was so expensive. So yeah, this is you have way too much money. Oh! Okay, Viper Maids, E-Daters for sure, am I right, chat? This is an E-Dater skin, 100%. They match with their duo. This is an E-Dater skin, 100%. What about this? I have no clue what skin this is. Is this Convex or something? This is a weirdo skin. I've never seen anyone use this. I got you. Weirdo skins? Yeah, it's really bad. Okay. Uh, this one is straight here. Sorry. Anyone who uses these skins, I am sorry. But anytime I see this, I think this gives you a, a negative buff. I don't even know what these skins are called. But this is, uh, cannot aim for their life. Moving on to, uh, Lowlander Fishy Skins. I have no money. Yeah, this is a no money for me. Okay. 
Um, Divine Swine is 100% E-Dater skin. 100%. The face of E-Daters worldwide. This one is... I've... This is a streamer skin. People don't use these. The only time people use these was to make videos on them. Okay. What is this called? I only know these skins as the, uh, Tron skins. That's the only way I know them. I think these are pretty good. I like how they look, but I think people just use them to show off that they bought the season one battle pass. This is an I'm Quirky skin. We don't have a bandwagon fan skin. Don't worry, it's gonna come soon. All right, Ego skins, chat. You know, I think we might need another tier. I don't know where to put some of these skins. Ego skins are weird, but if I'm just lumping everyone into absolute weirdos, I don't think you're an absolute weirdo for using this i think you have way too much money if you bought this because remember back in the day these were one of the first basic skins to have variants and people were like oh that's cool they have no effects but they have variants and i, I want to get this but if you were to buy a skin you wouldn't waste your money on this it's the people who had disposable income i think you have way too much money if you have this okay elder flame vandal let me just say the elder flame great set but i think it's something that people buy just because it's the first like legendary skin set or first like really amazing lots of effects so i think this is our first bandwagon okay this one goes straight to cannot aim for their life anyone i feel like this is a negative buff it reminds me of a budget sensation i don't like it okay moving on we've got forsaken what do we think of forsaken i think forsaken's a streamer skin i see so many people so many like high rank streamers they have the what's the white version called the sovereign version of the forsaken vandal so many streamers use this so so many use the vandal i'm gonna put it in the streamer skins i'm not saying it's it's not cultured i just think it fits better in here right okay gaia anyone uh this personally I love it so much. I personally use the knife a lot. I think it's cultured, but I do think that it might be in bandwagon. Personally, okay, I think this is cultured, but I don't know. Cultured? Okay, you guys smoke? I <laughs> this? Okay. Everyone knows the story about me and the Galleria skins. I really wanted to buy the Phantom back in the day. I'm quirky. If you have these skins, you think you have good skin taste, but you don't. You just want to be different. You just want to separate yourself from the crowd. All right, moving on. These are the uh, ball skins. These skins that twirl around. Anyone? No money, no cap? Can't aim. Really? All right, I'm gonna put it in can't aim. All right, this one, here we go. Glitch pop, the very first one with the glitch pop dagger. I'm gonna say this right now. I think glitch pop is overrated and I think uh, people just bandwagon the glitch pop. I think the next glitch pop is so much better. I think people just like the first glitch pop because it had a knife that changed colors. Screw it. Yeah, this is a bandwagon skin set. I think this glitch pop is e skin set. That's the, uh, hey man, can you drop me your glitch pop vandal or glitch pop phantom? I don't know why, but this reminds me of e -daters. I'm gonna just say none of these things are bad, okay? Just because if you're cultured or whatever, it doesn't mean that it's better than any of these other skins. This isn't really like a formal tier list where the top is the best and the bottom is the worst. We're just trying to classify the skins, you know? All right, screw it. Yeah, this is an e dater skin set. I can see so many e daters. What skins are these, chat? I think this is a I have no money skin. We're going in here, 100%. All right, gun skins. If you use the gun knife, the baton, I think you are a cultured person. 100%. Gravitational Uranium Neuroblaster skins cultured simply because of name. Yes, and also because the baton, right? This is a cultured skin. Especially if you have Gun Classic. Definitely not talking about myself, but if you have Gun Classic, 100% cultured. Okay, this is the I'm Quirky skin. I still see some people who use the knife and uh, they're just like, oh, it's not that bad. You know, season two battle pass. So it's pretty good. I, I like it. Looks alien. Looks like Reaver, but on a discount. Walmart Reaver. I think people stand by these skins. What do we think about the horizon? skin i don't think it's a no money skin because it's an actual skin you buy which means it's not a battle pass and i think the ones with no money just buy battle passes i think this isn't yeah like absolute weirdo i think this is the one of the weirdest green screen skins okay moving on battle pass andy again we cannot aim really okay i'll take it it's not that bad it's a simple skin okay but you cannot aim this is actually dog it's sensation on a budget. It's going in here. I have no money. It's a battle pass kid. It needs its own category. Okay. No friends. <laughs> All right. We're moving on. What are the infantry? I think these are cultured skins. These are for the cultured Andes. 100%. Infantry for COD players. Oh god, now that you say COD players, I don't want to put it in cultured anymore. My love for these skins. No, 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 we put you up here. What the hell is this? No friends? Okay, I agree. No friends. All right, 
Ion Skins Chat. Streamer? Streamer. 100%. This is a streamer skin. This is 100% a streamer skin. Okay. These are the, uh... Serenity. Okay, okay. I have no money, right? I think it's a I have no money skin. Okay, Edators, 100%. Jigsaw. Kingdom skins. No friends. If you bought the episode one battle pass, I assure you. And you're still using these. I swear to God. <laughs> Moving on. I think K-Tac's not bad. I don't see people use it anymore. I think it's a quirky skin. People like to use a knife. I think it's quirky. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna veto all of you. No one can talk to me, but this skin is for absolute weirdos. All right, moving on. We've got the Lux. Oh, God. I don't know where to put this. I feel like this is for weird people, too. I'm gonna put it in weirdos. I don't think I've seen any sane person actually buy the Lux skins. We're moving on, team. This is not bad, but I feel like this goes to the uh, E-Dater skin, mainly because this screams the Edgelord to E-Daters, and some E-Daters are like that. I just feel like it's an E-Dater skin set because of how edgy it is. Moving on, Mage Punk. Way too much money. If the selection of weapons isn't too great, like for example, if, if it's a Spectre, Marshall, Ghost, Bucky, and the knife is just like the default knife, and you bought this, I feel like you have a lot of money to spend. Mage Punk Ghost Best Ghost Skin in the game. Yeah, Mage Punk Ghost pretty good. Yeah, we're talking about buying the entire bundle. Let's move on. Second Mage Punk is a really good skin set. I like it. The Sheriff is nice. The Op is nice. The knife is kind of meh, but I think this is a streamer skin. What do you guys think? I think this is for streamers. Yeah, let's just put it as streamer. Okay, streamer skin set. All right, chat. This is a controversial one. The Minima skins. What do the Minima skins say about a person? Are they weirdos? Are they cultured? Do they have no friends? I'd just like to say, before you say anything, look at this beauty, okay? <laughs> look at this. Just look at it when you walk around with this, okay? What game am I playing? What game am I playing? <laughs> This is why Minima Aries. Ah, look at that scoping. <laughs> Back to the minimum. Where are you putting Minima? I need a barf bag. I swear if you don't put it in no friends. I think this is for absolute weirdos. <laughs> Not gonna lie. Absolute weirdos are culture. There's no in between. I agree, chat. Absolute weirdos, yeah. Okay, uh, this is a battle pass skin. So, uh, I have no money. So I use this skin. What is this? Nebula is an e-dater skin. I have seen actual e-daters who bought this skin. Gotta put that there. 100%. Neptune skins. This is a, uh, somewhat controversial. Not too controversial. Somewhat. Neptune cultured. I really like Neptune. Okay, but I'm thinking if it's my bias. Yeah, I think that dude's cultured. Screw it. I'm kind of biased. Yeah, yeah. This is a uh, cultured skin set for the cultured players. You guys like the glop, 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 glop? You know? Okay. Yeah, these are weird. No friends. Okay, this one's an I'm quirky. Sorry, I'm gonna veto all of you. Only my very first skin set. One of my favorite skin sets of all time. And it pains me to do this but I think it's a bandwagon skin set. It actually might be streamer, not bandwagon. Because you have Sinatra, you have Sabrosa, you have so many streamers using this skin. This one is me, okay? This is a bad... I don't care what anyone says. I think Origin is the most mid skin that everyone loves a lot. Okay, chat, where do you think this belongs then? I don't think this is cultured, okay? I don't think it's going up there. I think you have way too much money if you buy this skin. You put Origin up against any other skin of its price point, and I'm telling you, any other skin at its price point, people would probably choose that okay fine yeah yeah fine it's not a bandwagon scan it's you have way too much money uh what about this one chat no friends easy clap weird ass knife this is a yikers this is a cannot aim for their life the fox and frog skins actually they're both going in here all right chat moving on the new skins prelude to chaos beautiful Prime, I'm gonna just say this. This is my favorite skin. Every time I feel like my aim is doing shit, I go back to Prime, but I'm sorry, you're going into bandwagon fan. No. No, 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 no. If Prime released now, it would not be held in the same regard, but I love the Prime so much. Yeah. Mm, streamer. If they released Prime now, they would call it boring. Maybe, actually. Prism? Where are we going for Prism? No friends? I agree. This is also a no friends for me. And this is also a no friends for me. All these single color skins. Protocol. I think protocol is you have way too much money. I think it was expensive. I don't think it was worth the price. Yeah. 
This is good. I like these skins. They're simple and they're nice. I think this is a streamer skin too, chat. Uh, now we have Recon. I'm quirky. Great skin set. Would buy. But I think this is a quirky skin. Actually, I think it might be a bandwagon thing because everyone bought the knife when it came out just because it was the only Bala song, the only like type of knife there was. I think it might be bandwagon. Yeah. Yeah, Recon's, Recon's a bandwagon skin set. People just, yeah. Okay, Reaver, also one of my favorites. I think Reaver is honestly an e dater skin set. Not saying it's not cultured, okay? But I think so many e dators use the Reaver skin set. Even the biggest streamer who uses the Reaver skin set. Tens. Tens is really an e dater. He's a regular dater. Nah, this is an e dater's. Uh... Red one. Where are we going for red? Uh, Wardell used to use this a lot. I think this is... I don't know. No friends? No, I think this is a quirky skin. I think some people still use the red op just because of Wardell. Everyone also uses Spline. That's true. Wait, I think Wardell is more known for Spline. Yeah, let's put this in absolute weirdos. Wait, is this a battle pass skin? Okay, my bad. Let's put it here then. Yeah. First RGX. Okay. When the first RGX came out, nobody wanted it. Then streamers started to use it and everyone started the bandwagon on this skin set. So for me, this is either a streamer or a bandwagon. But I think this goes more in bandwagon fans because even those streamers, this only became really popular after they saw popular people using it. Which is why I think this is the epitome of a bandwagon skin set. So many people bandwagon onto the skin set. Even I hopped on the bandwagon. I didn't find them really nice at the start. I found them kind of weird and like, Oh, the sound isn't too great. I think RGX 2.0 is golden. I think this is a cultured skin set because I love the knife. Now we move on to Ruination. Ruination is one of the skin sets I regret getting. It's good, but I think it's not worth the price. I think this is you have way too much money. Moving on. Sorry, no debate. This goes all the way to the top. Episode 1, Act 3, Battle Pass, Ruin Dagger. It might be a streamer skin, now that I think about it. This is the best Battle Pass, okay? No one is ever... I'm going to get this ever again. Look at that twirl. And this was a battle pass skin. It's so good. Ruin the streamer bandwagon because it only got popular after tens mained it for a while. Really? You know, it might be a streamer skin though. It might not be cultured. What do you guys think? Do we put it in cultured or do we put it in streamer? Okay, I'm seeing a I'm seeing streamer. Okay, I'm seeing cultured. Okay, you know what? I'm putting it in cultured mainly because it's a battle pass skin. Okay, it's just too good. Way too good for a battle pass skin. Oh my god, these are the Rush skins. I have never seen these. I've never seen anyone actually use these. No friends. All right, Sakura. I'm quirky. I am quirky. I am quirky. I like to use the Sakura skins. e -daters? Wait, really? Why e -daters? Okay, I'll put it in e -daters, but why? e -daters for sure? Anime type meat? Okay, okay, makes sense. All right, Schema. I have no money. This is a battle pass skin. Yeah, this is XDR. I'm sorry, XDR. But uh, if you use the sensation, you are an absolute weirdo. Do not buy these skins ever, chat. Please do not buy these. We're moving on to Sol. What's the play on Sol? Cultured? I can't agree with cultured. I think it might be you have way too much money, but no, I agree. It's a cultured skin set. Yeah. Anyway. Ooh, these are great. This is an e dater skin for sure though. Shimmer, 100%. Let me just say, I was on Discord with my girlfriend. She saw the skin and she said, you better fucking equip that skin right now. Sylvanus, Sylv Sylvanus. This is I'm quirky, right? Some people use it. Some people think it's nice. No one uses it, really. Okay, fine. We'll demote it to absolute weirdos. Happy? Uh, what about this? Singularity. This is a mid skin set for me. I'm very sorry. This is, I have too much money. Actually, it might be a streamer skin set too. So many streamers use the sheriff. The sheriff is so popular. Moving on. Controversial time. Where is Mike going? Oh my God, the cultured spam. Here it is. Okay, fine. I'll put it up here. This is what you guys want. Understandable. What about the snow globe jet? Uh, absolute weirdos? No, I think this is a cannot aim for their life. People like equip those skins and they can't aim. 100%. Moving on, Cavalier. Where is the Cavalier going, chat? No money. Battle pass. Where are the Sovereign skins going? I think it's a streamer skin. We need to reshuffle these a bit because some of these doesn't belong in streamer skin, I think. Where does Spitfire go? I think Spitfire looks like a cannot aim for their life skin. I know it's a battle pass skin, but the vibes it gives me is uh, I'm an edgelord. I think I like flame decals on my skins. I probably main Phoenix. Moving on. 
Blind! 100% I'm quirky. All right. Yeah, you have no friends if you use this. No one, please, for the love of God, I never want to see these skins. Please don't use these. This one's uh, I have no money. 100%. Okay. This is decent, and I think these are quirky skins. Have you guys seen the knife on this? I think this is pretty cool. I think people would actually use this. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, you're weird. Actually, this might be an Edator skin. Any thoughts on this? This is the uh, Agent skins. For me, it's either Weirdos or Edators. Edators? I agree. Okay. This one's kind of hard to do. This is the one with a dual wheel. I think this is a, an I'm Quirky skin too. Chat, where are the tiger skins going? This one you actually have to buy. Too much money. Okay, I agree. Definitely agree. Yeah, they're decent though. Okay. All right. Titan male. I think if you use this skin, you are a person who is once again also quirky. All right, moving on. No friends. This is a streamer skin. Actually, no, this is bandwagon. 100%. Okay. I will explain why this is bandwagon. Mainly because everyone just bandwagoned on the kunai. So many people people bandwagoned on this and i would know because i bandwagoned on this skin too from personal experience i saw this skin set and i was just like yeah and then i was like you know the knife's kind of growing on me yoru yoru knife cannot aim for their life yoru knife andies rise up where are the yoru knife andies i think this is a cannot aim for their life all right moving on this is a weird ass skin but I think only people who uh, bought the Battle Pass use this. This is not bad. These skins, I honestly think, would go to I'm Quirky or E-Daters. This feels like an E-Dater skin. Actually, I'm Quirky. I have this Shroud Vandal. This is a Shroud Vandal. Is this a streamer skin? The Shroud carry this skin set enough? Shroud is a massive streamer. Yeah. We've got the Winter Wonderland. I know streamers bought it at the start to do the cane thing, you know, where you where you chop off the cane and make it into a shank. I think anyone who uses it now is a weirdo. <laughs> Sino Hunter. Seno Hunter? How do you pronounce this? Sino? Seno? Zeno? Alright, Zeno. I'm stupid. This is probably a streamer skin, but I think this is you have way too much money. Mainly because this is a pay to lose skin chat. You cannot see sh because of the radar. Okay, last skin of the day. I know where this goes. No one is gonna tell me otherwise. The Zed skins are way too expensive. Okay, they just have the name Zed slapped onto it, and that's why it's so expensive. It's way too much money. You're paying for the name. Well, actually, no, the music's pretty good too, actually. But if this came out without the Zed name and without the Zed song, actually, this is the appeal. But is it worth? Says you guys think it's culture? Okay. Okay. All right, chat. There it is. There's our final list. Oh, look at that. Everything's there. Okay. There it is. All right. If you guys want to say bye to YouTube, say bye to YouTube now. Thanks for coming, everyone. It was a good stream. Bye, guys.